Hey everyone, it's Phil from jailbreak.itouch.com. <clears throat> Today I'm going to show you how to downgrade your iTouch from 113 to 111 so you can have it jailbroken. So as you can see here right now, I see the iPod January soft, uh, software upgrade. What I did was I deliberately put my iTouch into updated to 113. So what I'll do is I'll uh, go on you later and I can show you that I am running 113. You can see here. If you look at the iTouch, you can also see that I'm running 113. You can see that there. So the first thing you need to want to do is you need to shut down your iTunes. Go to your task manager and see if you have iTunes helper up and running. That needs to be shut down. Let's see if I have it running iTunes Helper is not here. So the next thing you want to do is you, you have to download this application called Auto Down, which I'll provide the link. You can also visit jailbreakitouch.com to grab that, that link, but you should also see at the bottom of your bottom of the video here. There is a bat file called down.bat. So double click that. It'll tell you here what needs to be done. You hit enter. What it's doing now is going to put your I touch into recovery mode as you can see it. So you can do then if your iTunes does not start up. You can open up iTunes. And I'll come up and it says that you iPod is detected to an iPod recovery mode, you must restore it. So what you can do then is you can press enter, press OK, and then OK again. And then you can do what I've done is I shut down iTunes, bring iTunes up again. Okay. Shift restore. Find your 111. Press open. And it'll show that it's extracting the software. Now you can see it's preparing iPod for restore. So I haven't done anything to it. As you can see, the video and the, the iTouch in the left-hand corner of your screen is uh, is doing its thing. You can see right now preparing iPod for software for restore. <coughs> for instructions on jailbreaking your iTouch from 111 to 112, what you can do is you can also visit jailbreakitouch.com and we have detailed instructions on how to do that. We also have a YouTube video. The only thing right now that is missing, and I will say this in, this in video, uh, and if anything comes up, I'll make sure that it's listed on our website, is that unfortunately right now we don't have a repository for iPhone apps. Uh, the, the company that used to host them, that we used to get them from, uh, which was universal throughout the uh, throughout the web when jailbreaking your iTouch to get the iPhone apps, uh, that repository is down right now. So if you want to get the iPhone apps, what you can do is you can do a one-click restore to 113, which uh, jailbreakitouch.com has those has that video and instructions also. Um, that will get you your iPhone apps. The only problem is that uh, you won't get a summer board theme, so you won't get your summer board or your customize. Uh, what that does, it changes the look of your iTouch. Uh, the customize allows you to rename things, uh, you know, like your slider bar instead of saying slide to open, you can name it whatever you want. Uh, change the icon looks, you can change, with the customize you can change the, uh, the amount of docks you have at the bottom, the amount of icons you have on the docking station at the bottom. So if you don't really care about the themes, um, sorry, if you don't really care about the iPhone apps, you can you can just keep it at 111 or, or 112 and you can install all the, all the fun stuff.
Once again, all that stuff is at jailbreakdogtouch.com. We're growing pretty fast, which is pretty cool. You know, we've helped a lot of people out. All the sources we've gathered and tested around the web, we just we, we note them in our in our form board. Uh, the only catch uh, to getting any of the instructions is just sign up as a member. Uh, you'll see a member section open up once you log in, and in there has all the information. All of our videos, we take it through from the first step to the last step. That's why they seem long, but <clears throat> at least you get a chance to see everything that's going on. There's no camera stopping. Um, there's nothing in between. Uh, we've looked at some videos where they've explained how to do stuff and they, and they seem to get it working. Uh, they also stop the camera quite a bit, so what we've decided to do with our videos is take the process from one end to the other. So even though the process, uh, like jailbreaking 111 to 112, even though that process may take upwards of uh, 20 minutes, that video, particular video we have, is 28 minutes. But we're also showing a couple, uh, a couple extra things on there. You see it right from beginning, uh, right to end, on how everything works. Right now, it's showing us being dismissed. You can see all the wonderful album art. So as you can see, the eye touch is, is rebooting. <coughs> now what we do is we can set up as a new iPod. Click continue. And now you can see that I'm running 111. Very cool. Okay, so what I'll do now is I'll just show you the. Uh, uh, if you want to see, sorry, if you want to see the installation of uh, jailbreaking it for uh, 111, just visit jailbreakitouch.com or visit the next video, and we can show you how to do that. So thanks a lot, guys. And as you can see right now, it is a success. We're back down to 111, and uh, that's it. Thanks a lot, guys. Bye bye.